welcome to the turning point in this session let us calculate the moment of inertia of uh, the square about a diagonal axis so here i have considered a square a b c d a is the dimension of the square so we are uh, asked to calculate the moment of inertia about diagonal axis let a c be the diagonal so here a b dimension is a so then AC dimension is also a right as it is a square so all the sides are equal so I want to find the length of AC so you know so ABC is in the form of a right angle triangle right so from triangle ABC side square plus side square is equal to hypotenuse square so from that AC square is equal to a square plus a square from that I can write AC is equal to square root of 2A square so I can write that one as root 2 into A so that is the value of AC and next here I am supposed to calculate a moment of inertia about diagonal axis right let us make it horizontal let us make the uh, diagonal as horizontal for that I am drawing the square like this so first I am drawing a AC this is AC this is B this is T so just I have rotated it until AC is horizontal so here AC is uh, uh, horizontal axis right so if I calculate the uh, area moment of inertia of square about x axis so then it is nothing but area moment of inertia about diagonal axis for this geometry so here I can consider it as combination of uh, two right angle triangles if you observe the angle at the corner of square is uh, 90 degrees right so here the angle is 90 here the angle is 90 so these are nothing but right angle triangles so here I can consider this as uh, uh, combination of uh, two right angle triangles one is ADC plus another one is this is ABC so here I know the length of AC no problem with that earlier I have calculated it so which is nothing but root 2 into A there also no problem so I have calculated that so root 2 into A so I don't know the value of height for this triangle as these are uh, uh, as this is a uh, square so when I consider the diagonal it is going to divide the square into two equal parts so then it is also having the same height right so I am supposed to calculate height here for that I am considering uh, simple relation area of uh, square is equal to 2 into area of triangle here which is nothing but right angle triangle so here area of square this area is nothing but combination of these two areas right or addition of these two areas so then area of square is nothing but a square and 2 into area of a triangle so half into base into height base is nothing but root 2 into a height is nothing but consider that one as h so here 2 2 gets cancelled 1 a gets cancelled from that h is equal to a by root 2 so this is the value of height so now we can calculate uh, uh, moment of inertia of uh, this square about x axis so we know that for right angle triangle moment of inertia about x axis is nothing but a bh cube divided by 12 so for the first uh, right angle triangle let us consider that one is b1 h1 base 1 h1 cube divided by 12 plus for the second one consider as b2 h2 cube divided by 12 here the base one is root 2a height is uh, common h1 is equal to uh, a by root 2 we got that 
so b2 also same b2 is equal to b1 is equal to root 2a and h2 is equal to h1 is equal to so we can make it simple so i am considering with common letter 2bh cube divided by 12 that is equal to 2 into base is uh, root 2 into a height is uh, a by root 2 whole cube divided by 12 so i am simplifying it so once again i will write here that is equal to 2 into root 2a into a by root 2 whole cube divided by 12 a by root 2 whole cube divided by 12 so this is the relation here so simplifying it 2 into root 2 into a into so this is a cube divided by root 2 whole cube is 2 root 2 divided by 12 2 root 2 2 root 2 gets cancelled so which is nothing but a power 4 divided by 12 so this is a moment of inertia of the square about its diagonal axis AC so which is nothing but a power 4 divided by 12 thank you for watching if you like this video click on like button for more videos do subscribe my channel the turning point thank you all for watching